Well, I think we have a big thank you tonight, Madam President. If you could join me on the stage. Have a seat right here. So let's start with the, uh, the tough question. Whose fish was bigger? Whose fish was bigger? The fish that we caught. Whose fish was bigger? The fish? Yeah, your fish or my fish? The who? <laughs> the wahoo, yeah. <laughs> what you didn't see in the show is uh, you saw it on the credits. That's how many people were involved, and the numbers are actually bigger than that. Uh, the movement that we did around the country, the logistics that went into it, the advance work. Um, I, I joke that it's fun traveling with the president. It's difficult traveling with the president uh, to be able to see all those things that we saw in such a short amount of time. Uh, what you saw tonight, literally the appetizer. Uh, so many other things that we wanted to show, we just didn't have time. Uh, but I promise you, this is the first. We'll come back. Thank I promise. You. What was the thing that excited you the most about this show? Uh, the tour guiding, which was very difficult considering that I had so many guards telling me not to do this, not to do that, don't go there, don't go there. But I had to do it. So that's it, and I managed. Thank you. <laughs> well, you're used to running a country and not making a television show. Yes. Yes, you had to listen to me. You did. Yes, yes. I know. Actually, it was the first time you had driven a car in a long time. After 15 years, yes. And a stick. <laughs> Applause for the stick, come on. When people, we have a lot of Tanzanians here tonight, but for people who have not been, what's the first thing that surprises them about your country? About my country? Yeah. As I said before, the warmth of the people the um, great deal of hospitality we have. And uh, we are very friendly. So when you happen to be in Tanzania by mistake, you'll never regret it. And what was the thing that surprised you the most about just the, how we made the show? Yeah. The, the, the challenges? Actually... I'm mixed up. When, we, when I was doing it, I never knew that it would come out like this. And uh, a great deal of the job was done to make this film be like this. Because that was uh, the recording in different parts. And uh, you know better, Peter, how you did it. I don't know. <laughs> Actually, we were shooting 14, 15-hour days. Yes. Didn't get much sleep. Yeah. Uh, finishing around 10 o'clock, 11 o'clock at night, leaving at 4 or 5 in the morning. Yeah, yeah. Absolutely. And you remember the day we were doing the voicing? You call it voicing? The voiceovers. Yes, yes. voiceovers. We didn't have lunch. No. And we had late dinner. Yes. So the whole day was for voiceover. That was the... You tortured me. <laughs> Well, my favorite words were, do it again. Yeah. Yeah. I don't mind doing it again, yeah. I think she did quite well. Yeah. In the limited amount of time we have here, if we could turn the house lights up just a little bit. And, and the, great. If anybody's got some questions that they'd like to ask Her Excellency, just raise your hand. I, I, I'm having difficulty seeing, but if, got, if you can stand up, we'll be glad to answer them. Who's got a question? Don't be shy. Okay, right over there. Hi. Go ahead. Um, what is the best time to visit Tanzania? What time of the year? What's the best time of the year to visit? I think
think it's June, July, because it's not so hot and it's not weighty. It's mild. So that's the best time. But it depends. If you want to see the migration, then it's August. Right? Yeah, it's August. Yeah, but otherwise you can come anytime. We can stop the rains for you. <laughs> Other questions? Okay, go ahead. Go ahead. Remember Mike coming to you? Hi. Uh, my name is Gertie, and I'm one of seven children. I'm number six of seven. And my mother always told me that I was a diamond, and so I never knew anything else but my true worth. And so my question for you is that when you talk to fellow young girls, what is it that you tell them for them to gain this, the type of confidence that you have? Because you are so fierceless and wow, <laughs> I'm just blown away. <laughs> Maybe the thing I could tell the young girls is for them to be determinant on what they want to do. They have to be confident, listening to their inner voice, what they want to do, and stick to that. They might reach where they want to go. Yeah. Any other questions? Yes, yes? Over there? Well, I must say that uh, what a wonderful film. And your country is beautiful on film, but even more beautiful when you visit it in the real, as I have done. <laughs> you know Thank you. Who is that? Who just said that? My name is Lloyd Ward. OK. And I'm in the back balcony. Thank you. Way back. <laughs> <laughs> OK. And I, I do have a question, though. Sure. My, my question is this. Um, I wonder how, as impressed as I am with your country and that film, I'm more impressed with you, Mama Samia. And I must say that the combination that you have of strength and warmth and relevance and humor mm -hmm. is unmatched. Mm -hmm. And what you are doing in representing your country is a true tribute, mm -hmm. and I salute you. Thank you. Thank you. Nice to hear that. Yeah. We have time for one or two more questions if we've got them. At the back. In the back, yes. Up, oh, they're coming over. Was there? I can't see. It's over there. Hello, everybody. My name is Maria. And I am a Tanzanian young woman, um, Madam President Shikamo. And my question is, for a young actress, a Tanzanian young actress, who's very proud of my country, what advice or what help will my government offer to continue what you have started, which is amazing, to continue showing my country to continue doing, following your steps to show the world what a beautiful place Tanzania is. Thank you. Thank you. Actually, I'm starting to connect the actors and actresses of Tanzania to the world. Yesterday I had uh, a very good meeting with the big fives of the travel and tourism industry here in USA and elsewhere. Another big five. <laughs> Another big five in the, in the industry. So I had a very good discussion with them and one of, the, of those discussions, I met someone who is working with the Paramount Film yep. and AMC. So we had a very good discussion to connect the culture and um, arts of Tanzania to their industry. So I think I, I, I have started to work for you. Yeah, give me much time and then, yeah. I should, I should tell everybody that uh, tomorrow we're heading west and on Thursday night we're going to have a second premiere 
and ironically on the studio lot at Paramount Pictures in Los Angeles. So we'll be having a, a, a very large input of the entertainment community visiting then. Yeah, yes. Thank you, Peter. Last question, if we've got one. Yeah. Yes. I'm hi. looking. Oh, we got one here. Okay. Oh, hi. How are you? Um, uh, Eddie Bergman. Um, uh, what an inspiration. Um, I've been to Tanzania, I think, more than 25 times. And I... Whoa. Um, here with my, uh, my, my daughter, I told her the next time I'll go, I'll bring her. But thank you for coming to New York and bringing Tanzania to New York. Um, my question is, um, how can the film be used to promote domestic tourism? And uh, will the film be shown within Tanzania? And the answer is yes. Thank you. Uh, after it premieres, uh, t it actually premieres tonight in Chicago on the PBS affiliate station there. It then rolls out over the rest of the country through all the other PBS affiliates over the next two to three months. As of this Friday, it's available on Amazon Prime and also Apple TV Plus. And then, on the 28th of this month, I will be with the president for the premiere. Yes, oh, in Arusha too, yes. Um, and we'll be there for the premiere. And then, after that, it airs in Tanzania. Absolutely, yes. And Swahili subtitles. We got it. Before we finish, just a housekeeping note. I would ask everybody if they could please remain seated while the presidential party leaves, but we're not really leaving. We're going up to the rotunda. You'll see the performers back, and we'll have a lovely reception after that where we can all come over and, and congratulate our star. So thank you very much, everybody. Thank you very much.